Now I will take you back to the year 1888. In the 19th century Europe, there was a very wealthy industrialist with over a hundred industries, all in the field of armament, explosives. Unfortunately, in those times, the means of communication were not as strong as they are today. And in France, somehow his brother had died, but due to some miscommunications, it was perceived that that individual had died. One fine morning, he opens up a newspaper, and in the obituary section of the newspaper, he is shell shocked to see his own photograph. But what disturbed him the most was what was written in that obituary. It mentioned Alfred Nobel, the merchant of death, and the person who grew rich by mutilating people and killing them is now dead. He was shocked. Is this how people are going to remember me? Is this what I will be known for? That is the very question that we are addressing today. So, he decided he had some millions of dollars of worth, of wealth. He decided to institute what is now famously called the Nobel Prize given in various fields to include the sciences, peace and literature. 